My name is Jason Davis and I'm a consultant anaesthetist at uh, London Islands Hospital. I've worked in London Islands for 14 years now. Well, I was working in Toronto, uh, um, doing some pain research, and uh, it was about April, May, and I think we'd had as many murders in Toronto that year as they'd had the entire year before. We had a serial rapist on the loose in our local shopping mall. So things were brought, um, and we were just surfing the internet and came across the Open Times website and it read in uh, big bold type new lollipop man for mower and my wife and I thought we'll have some of that the key strength for Lauren Islands is its size actually I think it's small but perfectly formed um, it's a tight team uh, and that runs across all the specialties, you know, we, we're eight consultants and we work very, very closely together um, because there's nowhere to hide. You, you have to work that closely together uh, and I think that's our strength. Oh, I mean, there's, there's, there's loads of, I mean, music is, is uh, vibrant in Oban and, and around Oban as well. A lot of traditional music, folk, uh, Scottish folk music. Other than that, more contemporary music as well. And the, the venues are, are numerous. Plenty of choice as far as restaurants are concerned, good food, um, plenty of seafood. Uh, there's, from an art perspective, I know we have writers clubs, lots of uh, watercolour artists, oils. Uh, there's a local art society. Uh, I sing in a choir. Um, so that it really does spread over a whole breadth of uh, artistic likes and dislikes. So I think there's a little something for everyone. During my leisure time, I <laughs> spend a lot of time singing. Um, obviously, out, out and about, is, as I've said, is, is wonderful. So we, we do a fair bit of island hopping, visiting the different parts of, uh, of Western Scotland particularly. Um, I play a bit of guitar, I write a few songs uh, and I generally just like going out and meeting people and having fun. The challenges I think are again related to its size. It's a small town, it's a small hospital and there is, there is nowhere to hide really. It, it, it keeps you honest because um, any mistakes you do make or any difficulties that you do have are immediately evident and I think that's a good thing. I think the advice I would give would be come and see us, come and see the area, come and speak to the people because again, we're small uh, and it has to fit you. So I think that's an important decision that you have to make in person. As far as my experiences are concerned, I think, I, I think it's the best kept secret in healthcare. I've said this time and time and time again. The NHS is a challenging place to work at the moment. And I have actually thought about moving on and, and finding a different challenge. But when I looked around, I really couldn't find anywhere better to work. <laughs>